Thank you guys for tuning in. And today on Craving It, we're going to make a childhood favorite spaghetti. Watch this entire video. First, I wanted to start off with my ground beef. You want to make sure you get it seasoned. I use seasoned salt, onion powder, garlic powder, black pepper, salt. Put it on medium heat. Let it fry down. At the same time, I have my water boiling for my noodles, my corn on the cob, and I have my pan for my sauteed vegetables. I'm going to quickly slice up this bell pepper, check back on my meat. It's getting halfway done. So now we want to go ahead and start with the vegetables. With butter melted in a pan, you want to add your bell peppers, some mushrooms, salt, pepper, and like a teaspoon of garlic. And then I'm going to go ahead and add my corn to the boiling water. With that corn, I just want to put like two tablespoons of milk and a teaspoon of butter in there and let that boil. As you can see, the meat is finally done. Now I want to get this meat drained. You don't want to pour it down your sink. You want to have a way to collect that grease. While looking out for your vegetables, making sure you're not burning those. While in the process, I thought, hey, I got a taste for some homemade garlic bread. So I made some. Make sure you guys go to my page to check out that full video. Now I'm adding my noodles to the boiling water. They should be done in like 10 minutes. You just cook them to their al dente. Now you take your meat and your vegetables and you combine them in the same skillet. When it comes to the sauce, I didn't do it homemade, but I do like to get this great value tomato and basil and add my own seasonings to it just to give it a kick. I'm going to add some oregano, some Italian season, some pepper flakes, and black pepper. Give it a good mix and it's ready to be served. Now there's two types of people. One that mixes it all together or one that serves their spaghetti just like this. And if you're one of those people, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And again, thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed.